in a building collapse. We have Fox 26's Tiffany Justice out there. Tiffany, what can you tell us about what is going on? What does the scene look like on your end? Right, extremely active right now. We do know that this happened a few hours ago, but take a look behind us. Numerous amount of fire engines right behind us. And at this point, they are waiting to bring in a structural engineer to even try to go back into the building. We need to make sure it's safe to go back in, so they're waiting on that engineer. What we have learned after speaking with the fire chief is that those three individuals that were inside the building were installing a stairwell that was about at a level five. Level five is how far they got up. And after they installed it, it actually came down on them, killing three. They had to, uh, the fire department had to come back in and rescue one, and that person was brought to a nearby hospital. We are waiting to see their condition, but still a very active scene here. Have you been able to speak with any of the firefighters out there by chance? We have been. You know, they're working really hard to make sure that there is nobody else inside. Right now, we have been told that everyone else has been accounted for about 240 people, but they need to make sure that nobody else is in that rubble. And obviously, it's very soon in the investigation. What exactly are they saying could be the possibility of causing this collapse? Right, so that's exactly what they're saying. Really early in the investigation right now, but they know it has to do with the stairwell that they were installing in that building right behind us. It's a building under construction, and at the time, of this uh, disaster or this uh, injury, that stairwell that they were installing actually came down and everyone that was working around that stairwell, they had rubble fall on them. Tiffany, have you been able to speak with any of those bystanders out there? Did anyone actually see it go down? You know, I know there were a lot of people uh, watching. It's actually an apartment complex right next to us. We have not been able to get any closer to the scene. You see that caution tape right here. So we have not been able to speak to any bystanders, but of course they have been very intrigued. They've been out here taking photos and they most likely want to know what is going on as well. Alrighty, Fox 26's Tiffany Justice out there. Thank you for this developing information. We'll be sure to check back in over there and hopefully um, that person who was sent to the hospital is okay. All right, for now, we're going to head back out to that event with Joe Biden. He's speaking out there 